quite the journey for you to get here. I mean, we got to, to see a little bit of your story, which was a very emotional story in the, in the video package. But I just wonder kind of what you're feeling right now, just a days out from your Bellator debut. Man, I just feel I'm blessed, man. I'm blessed to be part of this, and I made it. I just like I'm proud of myself, too. Uh, what I went through and made it here. I'm so excited. I can't wait for Saturday night. It's going to be an amazing night. Can you go back to that moment where you got the contract and we got to see it and, and your emotion was very real? I mean, what was going through your head at that time? Did you have an idea it might be happening? Were you surprised? What was that moment like for you? Oh, man, it was it was a cra crazy, crazy, man. I, like, I didn't believe it for a second, almost like overnight. Like, I was like, this is shit really happened. I text Jay, like, this is true. And they told me, yeah, believe it. It's a fucking true. Like, it's, it, was, it was just like, like, really surprised. Like, I, I think the biggest things happen in my life to like ex make me that excited, you know? And I know how hard, you know, fighters, they work so hard. Some of them, they made it, some of them not. And like, you know, always in it, you win, you lose, and you don't know like if you're going to make it or not. And fighter life is, is tough, it's is hard every single day from training, from struggle, everything. And you don't know if you're going to make it or not. And make it as, and thank God, and first thank God, made it. And, and with the top guys already, like, it's, it's, I'm so excited. Your career had kind of been on hold for a little bit. Had you, had you given up on the dream that you would fight it for a big promotion, or, or did you still believe that maybe it could happen? I always believe in myself, like uh, believe in God, believe in myself, and believe in my family and people who support me. And uh, no, no, I never give up. But you know, we fighters, like we have a struggle. We have like, but I was scheduling last year for a couple fights, that didn't happen. And but. I didn't stop training. I didn't stop like you know. I always, I always look up. I, I didn't, I didn't give up in the war. I give up here in my career now. Never, never. On the main card now as well, right? We thought you were just going to be on the prelims, but they changed the schedule. They put you on the main card. When you got that news, then what did you think? <laughs> I bust like literally. <laughs> I bust little kid in my in my Instagram start dancing and stuff. That was so excited. I never bust stuff like that. But I was like really excited. Like it's it's, it's the same. I I don't like, not mean I don't care, but it's, it's mean a lot to me. But it's a fight, fight. Undercard and the main card, the main main event is a is a fight. It's it's gonna be in the show, you know. But for this opportunity being the main card with those guys like is awesome man and being tv is is i'm blessing man i'm blessing as your career progresses i mean your story what you went through how you got here is amazing do you want your career to stand for something or represent something or do you hope people just see you as a fighter with the, starting from scratch uh, the first always like first thing to me i I want those like new kids when they grow up look up to me because I never give up in the war. I, I'm a fighter outside and inside the cage. I always say that. I, I, I never give up in, 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 in my dream. Never. And even never give up in my family and even my country. I'm, I, I, I born and raised in Iraq. I, of course, I present Iraq too. And I, present, I, I serve for U.S. Marines there because I see it is right. And they are warriors, and that's what I love to do. I, I, I love to fight, man. I love to fight. I'm, when I, I started fighting, I started being in martial arts when nine years old. And over 20 years, like, it's, it's, like, it's tough to take this away from me, man. That's why, like, do not give up on your dream. That's why, I, to people, don't give up on dream. I went through a lot in my life. I lost friend, I lost family in front of me, got killed, and almost almost killed myself a couple of times but when I believe in God and believe in myself I can make it and I made it here. I'm 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 here.